Hi, in this tutorial I will show you how to create this 5 strand braid combo using two different 5 strand braids. Create the first part line on front which will separate the bigger braid on back and the headband braid on front. Then I use some water for my hair to make braiding easier. Take the section of hair. Then separate the section in 5 equal pieces. Then start the braid. Take first the rightmost strand and bring it under, then over the middle, then from the left side under and over the middle. Again from the right, under and over the middle. Then from left, under, add some hair from the left side and then move the whole strand over the middle strand. Take again the rightmost strand and bring it under and over the middle strand. Then from the left, under, add hair and over. Then from the right, under and over. From the left, under, add hair and over. Right, under and over. Then the left, under, add hair and over. Right, under and over. Left, under, add hair and over. As you can see, I add hair only from the left side of the braid. That is what makes the braid stay on the rightmost side of the part line. Just simply repeat this pattern until you braided the whole frontmost section into this braid. Continue the braid after the last addings. This braid must be reached inside the bigger braid, so make sure it's long enough. Begin then the bigger 5 strand braid. You need again 5 equal sections of hair. I start again from the right side, take the outmost strand and bring it under, then over the middle. Then the left one under and over the middle. Again the right strand under. Then add some more hair into that strand and move the whole strand over to the middle. Then the left under, add hair and over the middle. Right under, add hair. and over the middle. Left under, add hair and over the middle. Right under, add hair and over the middle. Left under, add hair and then over the middle. 
As you can see, now I'm adding hair from the both sides of the braid, but basically the technique I create this braid is exactly the same as the first one. To get more volume for this hairstyle, you can pancake this braid by pinching the edges of the braid and pulling them out gently. Do not touch the inside edge of the braid, that will keep the braid neat and tight so it won't undo during the day. Measure time after time when it's great time to add smaller braid inside the bigger one. Try to follow with that the natural path of the first braid so it will stay nicely inside the bigger braid and you don't need the puppy pins for this. When you added all the hair and the smaller braid inside the bigger one, pancake the braid if you like to and then continue the braid until the end of the hair. I finish this hairstyle by using beautiful clip from Johnny Loves Rosie. And here's the final result of this hairstyle. Thank you for watching this video. Hopefully you like it and I will see you soon again. Have a great day.